this is what many of you wanted. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're all okay, doing well if possible, and safe. This is Xenoblade Chronicles, definitive edition on the Switch. Um, you know, I heard it was a really good port and a really good game. This will most likely not be a full stream. It won't be. I'm going to be playing a lot of this on my own if I end up getting into it. Um, but I was told by multiple people that I should probably stream me playing it, you know, like the first time. I haven't touched it yet. So this is my first time checking the game out. And I'm going to do it live because, again, a lot of people were like, Vin, you, you really should do it live on stream. So, all right, fine. Let's check it out. But um, if anything, what I'm probably going to end up doing is if I like the game, if I get into it, I'll probably end up doing what I did with Dragon Quest XI, which is, you know, every now and then come back to it and continue uh, playing off stream for like 80% or more of the, of, the, of the game. So don't expect too much, but I might like this game. Listen, you know, I've, um, I know it's, it's not going to be like immediate. I'm going to have to play it a bunch to really get it and to get into it. Um, as long as none of the characters are called dead hard men, or others eat like weird like floating slug bugs I'll probably enjoy it we will see twiles of mana alright Vinny did you get the second ending in Dragon Quest 11 um I, yeah, I did 100% just about in uh, Dragon Quest XI. It was, it was good. It's good. I don't know what to do here, so I'm not going to do anything. I think I'm just going to just start the game. Listen, all I know about this is Shulk wearing underwear. That's it. I know that Shulk wears underwear and I know that he um, is really feeling it and he has a sword that's almost a lightsaber long ago the world was nothing more than an endless sea cloaked in a boundless sky reaching as far as could possibly be imagined my mic sounds fuzzy then two great titans came into existence Try to avoid spoilers if possible too, Chad. I'd appreciate that very much. The Bionis and the Maconis. I have my air conditioner on. Is that the fuzziness? Whatever it is, I hope it sounds okay. Um, so that's a hell of a start. The Titans were locked in a timeless battle. That's how Titans do in most things. Until at last, only their lifeless corpses remained. Eons have passed. Now, our world, this vast land stretching across the remains of the Bionis, is under attack from a relentless force. Wait, they literally live on the, on the things? Is this Halo? Oh. I, it's get away from me it's it's hey it's English halo I 
Oh fuck Laguna. They're advancing down our weak right flank. For a bunch of soulless machines, they seem to know a thing or two. But we'll see. Vinny, audio is delayed? Yes, it is. You're goddamn right it is. That's what I've been trying to tell you. Young man. We've been given the order to retreat. We're pulling back the line to Colony 6. Ah, that's where we'll set up the last line of defense. Yeah, that's a good idea. Any more time spent hanging around here, and we're done for. Count me in. We gotta get out of here. Or we can stay and fight. What? Ah! We may die if we take a stand here, but staying gives us the chance to change our destinies. We have the Monado. Uh-oh. Stupid beast! Your body can't take any more of the Monado. I can tell by just looking at you. Getting short-sighted in your old age, Dixon. I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm still in control. I don't know if I should do the offset negative or positive. I talk sense into a beast. Let's do this. I'm going with you. You'll need someone to drag your corpse off. As long as you think you've still got the strength in you, old man. Oi, you two! We've been ordered to pull back! I'm leaving! Well, I say you're coming with us. What would we do without those? <sighs> the enemy's second When wave. we get to menus, There's I'll be able to see how synced it is. It's now or never, Dunban. Hey, these Let's faces look better than got. they did in the Wii. We'll give them a warm Homs welcome. Acknowledged. Yeah. Huh. What are they trying to prove? I'm not throwing my life away. No point dying in some godforsaken field. Nothing for it. I'll have to use Dunban as a decoy. Yeah, that should give me time to escape. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. So uh, I'm okay. Where's the menu? Uh, no menu yet. I'm gonna just check out some. Th this is normal. I'm just checking out some um, some stuff to fix the delay on your end because it's gonna be delayed for me. But that seems good, right? Now it seems good. Alright. Alright, so target an enemy to display the battle palette, and then uh, select fight and press A to battle. God, I'm playing so many games that have this perspective and have swords. PSO2, Trials of Mana, 378P. You cannot use an art in the following circumstance if you're out of range and the conditions are not met. Monado Enchant, Monado Buster. Buster! Right. A lot you want to get busted. So you don't actually slash the sword, it does it for you. Go. Got that enchant. That's good. What about this Monado? You should use enchants. Did I not just do that? It's about managing arts and movement. Okay. Booster! Alright. Went down to Blackpool. Grab a little bit of fish and chips. Alright. Ah. 
You've got to be kidding! It's their main force. Looks like the Mekon are hell-bent on taking us out. They'll have to be if they want to beat us. Now, let's even the odds a bit. You heard him. This dude, one of these dudes looks like old Bunker. Axel Rose. Let's do this! All we need is just a little patience. Dumb man. I ain't going down that easily. Tombat! You alright? Oh, what does it look like? I'm still good to go. I son the luminary. <laughs> Must survive. Yes, even a hero's gotta reach his limit eventually. <sighs> Monkar! What are you doing? That way is. Sorry, brothers. Hate to drop this on you, but it's the Monado they're after. So have fun keeping them occupied for me. I'm getting the hell out of here. Monkar, you dirt. Ah, oh, don't worry. I'll organize your funerals. <laughs> well, see you, boys. Wait. It's the the eyeliner. Huh? That's how I knew he was a bad guy. If this is a joke, it ain't funny. Looks like this is it. At least we know our luck can't get any worse from here. Dumbad? Dixon, take care of the survivors. Dumbad, what are you playing? Those idiots. I'll just come and get the Monado when everything's quiet down a bit. That thing's gonna be mine! No. No, you probably won't. It's Breath of the Wild. That's happened to me so many times in Breath of the Wild. The people of Bionis are just waiting here for you to pick us off. You are sorely mistaken. I love Xenoblade Chronicles, Xenoblade Chronicles, Xenoblade Chronicles, Xenoblade Chronicles. Sorry. So is it? You know what? I don't want to ask questions, because there's probably spoilers, but... They're living on the Titans, and that's interesting. And I have some... Oh, I wonder where, where that's gonna go. Yep. Chat saying yes, I, I... okay, yep. A Mechon M71! Oh god, is that Shulk? I bet I can use its optical system to align one of the anti-air batteries. Am I gonna have to hear this the whole game? Oh, no good. It's broken. Nah, it's not the so bad. Section. It's no Trials of Mana, I'll tell you that much. It's buckled. <sighs> it's completely useless. Ugh. Is this the original VO? From the Wii version? It is, okay. Huh? An M69! It had to be that number. <laughs> its armor would be perfect for making a shield. If I can just get it off, I should be able to... His name is Shulk. Shulk, Shulk. Skywalker. Right. It's not a mechon. It's just a crabble. It was using the mechon armor as a shell. I'll lure it away and topple it. When it's down, use your arts to finish it off. When HP is depleted, the character will be incapacitated. Huh! Backslash! Back 
slash. There it is. Okay, so cooldowns. Uh, is this an MMO, but single player? Yes. Oh, fuck. Each character has a special art called a talent. Select it, press A. And then the gauge fills up every time an auto attack hit connects. acoustic guitar. The green ring stops you escaping. Defeat the monster to make the ring uh, disappear. Yes, the music in this game, I already know much of it from Smash, and uh, I know it's great. I know Yasunori Mitsuda did uh, one of the songs, and he's, as you know, a hero of mine. Oh, okay, because we, we didn't... Shulk won't automatically just, like, fight the thing. You gotta initiate a battle. Okay. Aggro is the measure of a monster's feelings of animosity towards each party member. Oh. The more damage a monster takes from a party member, the greater aggro. If the member of the party becomes target of monster's wrath, an aggro ring will appear. What about an aggro crack, brah? Wow, this really is MMO. Oh, no. I hope I like this. Backslash deals more damage if he attacks from behind the monster. Bonus effect from arts. It'll be, um... Highlighted, if you can get that. And then when an aggro ring appears around rain, Shulk has a chance to use backslash from the rear. Yeah, get get rain. Don't, don't get me. I'm feeling it! Yes! Thanks, Ryan. Ryan. That was a close one. Ryan Johnson. Now, what were you doing wandering off by yourself? Stay where I can keep an eye on you. It's pretty dangerous outside of the colony. There are all kinds of monsters. Yeah. But thanks to you, we got it, Shell. Everyone in the colony is going to be really happy. I'm more worried about you than the Shell. No, oh, whatever. Knowing what you're like, at least you'll make a decent weapon out of it. This scrap driver's excellent. I just learned by watching Dixon make weapons. Of course, Dunban's weapon still beats them all. The Monado. The Monado! I hope I can figure out the secret of his power one day. You will It's think. love. Anyway, That's what it is. It's friendship and love. That's the power. If I'm late for drills again, old Square Tash is gonna kill me. Square Tash? Oh, the Defense Force... It's Colonel. not about hating our enemies, it's about He's loving ourselves. Scary. That's the true it. power of the Monado. Sorry, I didn't mean for you to come all the way out here during your break. Don't worry about it. Let's get back. I'm really feeling myself lately. I, I have high self-esteem. And the power of the Monado has increased tenfold a resu as a result. <clears throat> the path to the next main story objective is displayed on the minimap. Um, you can switch by pressing L. See, I'm trying to get all of the reading. So you are to display the guidance panel. And that's the story memo, and you can use it to close the memo as well. Press ZL to display additional camera controls. For further information, see other articles in the tutorial menu. Because no game comes with an instruction manual anymore. Um, there's- you can't save during battles and story events. You can save most other situations. There's an auto-save feature. That's good. Alright. You can review the tutorials at any time. Ah! Oh! Theater event allows you to rewatch stuff. Yeah, like, every... every game like this that I've been playing recently, where it's like, third person, dude with a sword, 
all of them have had very slightly different controls, except the B button has been jump every time. So now, like, I have to rewire my brain yet again. Shulk, that's kind of... These are just like little rabbits. People have told me that, you know, the combat eventually clicks. Uh-oh, I'm fucking dead! Alright, that was fun. Didn't expect to be killed by a little bunny rabbit this early in the game. But, you know. Um, again, maybe I'm just too used to Trials of Mana. Wow, he really says that a lot. Like, he, that's... That's not just like a Smash meme. We can, definitely do this. can you move away from enemy attacks? No. Um... Sorta. Not much. Okay. I see what they're going for with the battle system. I, I kind of get it a little bit more now, um, as opposed to, you know... Like the Trials of Mana approach, where it's an action RPG, or the, um, you know, strict Final Fantasy VII... Like, half and half, but you're still in, like, action mode, or the turn-based. It's like a weird combination. Go. Vinny, don't expect much from this game's combat. It's really a watered-down single-player MMO. So, I mean, some people have said it gets good. Like, people were saying that the combat actually does end up being pretty fun eventually. There we go. Vinny, nobody ever shuts up during this game. That's cool. Alright. Uh, I initially was a bit bummed out about the combat, but the game has grown on me real well. Okay. Someone said, if you're struggling with the controls, try swapping the stick inputs from the Switch menu. That way you can move your character with the right stick while selecting arts with the D-pad. I, I don't want to move my character with the right stick, that's weird. Uh, that's- that's kind of real weird. Uh, there's collectibles here. You get a reward if you collect all the things. Well, I mean, the resolution is definitely, like... ...weird at times. Well, this looks nice. I mean... It's, it's a decent-looking... ...Wii game. But the, yeah, the resolution was the thing that people were concerned about the most. And I kind of, I kind of see that. Again, these poor, these poor, like, weird rabbit things. Vinny, you should have seen this on the Wii. No, I've heard, I've heard. And I've, listen, I know people consider this to be one of the best JRPGs in years. You know, so I had to see what it was all about. I've procrastinated getting this game many, many times. The 3DS version I procrastinated, the Wii version I procrastinated. So, I wanted to give it a shot. You know. 
I mean, while we're all stuck at home still for a while, I mean, mostly, um, I figured it would be good to to have this and see if I like it. Also, Dragon Quest XI was such a pleasant surprise that I ended up, you know, loving that I figured, I don't know if I want to miss out on this one again. And, you know, people were saying the resolution gets real crusty in handheld mode. And it will. I know it will. But, let's see. As for the for the moment, I'm enjoying it. So the resolution isn't great, but the world design is top-notch. There are some really stunning locations later on. Cool. They all have these big wooden treasure chests within their corpse. Yeah! Oh fuck, gah, gah. They have to feel it. Fight! Yeah! Oh! If you don't like using the D-pad for choosing arts, you can change the controls to swap the D-pad left and right to L and R so you can choose arts while moving, but I suggest you do that early to get used to the change. Uh... Maybe. I think I'm okay with the controls right now. Number nine? Here we are. I better stop in at HQ. You off to the weapon development lab? Yeah, when I've sold any parts I can't use. All right. See you later. I can't believe The Force Awakens was just this game. But, you know, different. The story will progress even if you don't do any trading or complete any quests, however, using these features may give you the advantage in the game. Yeah, um, so the game is about 100 hours, apparently, with the side quests. So I wasn't sure I was gonna do all that. Uh, we'll see. I mean, I didn't expect to do the side quests in Dragon Quest, either. I wanted to get a couple items, chat. That's all I wanted to do. Uh, I don't always do all the side quests in games like this. But I'll probably end up doing a bunch of them. If I stick with it. Again, as long as there's no one named Die Hardman. Vinny, um, I am pleased to see your quest continues to play the game of every Smash Brothers character. There, There is one I can think of that probably won't be happening. Kirby. I don't want to play any, any Kirby games. Oh, Shulk, you've been out again. Well, let me guess. Searching for scrap map was usual. Not that it's scrap anymore when you get your hands on it. 
Oh, this is gonna be a fun playthrough to voice. Whoa, whoa, what's all this then? Wow, I can't just, like, enter this person's house. Like, in most RPGs, you could just, like, fucking break down their door, break their pots, steal their items. Okay, so there's there's some weapons. There's there's knives too. Shulk, yeah, can't use any of these weapons, but it was nice. It was nice to look at them. Do you get to see any of this stuff? Like, if I were to wear the bikini top, w would that show on, on Shulk? Yeah, right? This is all cosmetic? Yes and no? I don't know what that means, but alright, thanks. Oops. There's vanity slots, too. It, it, it really is a single-player MMO, isn't it? Wait, that's a helmet? What? What? How do I... Oh. I can't take off the slippers. Okay, I'm gonna be making a movie. Okay. Sorry, I'm sorry, what are you? Has friends seen other crystal formations on the surface? He formed by high pressure and heat inside the body of Bionis. Well, why did you warp? What the fuck was that? Well... Well... I wanna buy. Well, well, I can't buy. There's no buy option. Never mind. Time of day hit 1800, and then... Oh, I see. I see. It's an auto-run option. You can set the time of day. You want... What do you need? Uh, you need... Scales. You get it for me? Thanks! You can get small scales by defeating Peronaxis. I hope it's not too much trouble. Nice music. What is it? Curious kind of light that ether lamps generate. Doesn't seem mechanical. They're very useful. The best part is they don't cause pollution. Now that's something worth researching. 
Talk to named residents, and uh, it will register them on the affinity chart. Is this like Majora's Mask? You don't get too bogged down in all the quests. You can do most of them just by going through the main areas of the game. Fair enough. What is it? Items are exchanged one for one. Choose the item you want. And uh, you can only trade if you hand over an item that's worth more money than the one you want to take. Handing over a really valuable item might get you a thing. Um, what then? I bet you do. What is it? The Giants. Have you ever heard of them? But my research isn't exactly proceeding as planned. I really would like to investigate. Investigate what? I think I clicked out of it by accident. What is it? I really like to investigate some of their ruins at some point. Okay, I get it. Choke. Why? Why are you naked? Well. Yes. Want to guess what my job is? You'll never guess. I'm a critic. No one else tells it like it is, and from the commoner's perspective. Don't make a lot of cash, but my work is as good as gold. Yes? Yes? Something peachy happened to the other day. I don't think I should tell you about it, though. It's got to go in one of my articles. Hello. I feel like I'm doing pretty well for myself. Better than that guy who goes down by the bridge every night. Is he learning how to argue or something? Bit silly, that. That bit silly, that. Also, I think I'm happier than the residential district gatekeeper. She always looks like she just smelt something funny. Truth is, living the good life is my specialty, so if you need any help with that, I'm the lady to ask. So, yeah, named residents I should be talking to. That seems to be... Yeah. <laughs> Night time is very quiet. This is my favorite time of day. When it's daytime, kids are loud and noisy. That annoys me loads, so I like nighttime best. I like nighttime laser loads. Hello. There's a laser load of suspicious types huddled up in here. No idea what they're talking about. But I want nothing to do with them. Alright. I'm off to a secret meeting. Doubt I'll make it on time though. Why? Because I overslept of course. Wait. Don't dare tell anyone that. Alright, and Carl? Colony Bottoms versus Broken Part. No, never mind. Uh, colony Bottoms seems... I have those. Broken Part could be nice. Um, I don't have anything that's cheap. I don't want to part with anything. Trade Pant for Pant. I'm sorry, my shulk never wears pants. But that's just how it goes. All right. I'm always telling him what I want stuff I'm meant to keep quiet about. I ain't supposed to be the leader. How can I lead anyone if I'm being careless all the time? I mean, there's various English accents that I can mangle for you. If you'd like. Yeah, just keep mangling, no problem. How's it going? People round here are blinded by a false sense of tranquility. Don't they remember what we went through a mere year ago? Vigilance and cautiousness are all we need right now. Sorry, stop. This is terrible. How's it going? 
So we won the battle last year, so what? Our defense force is still as weak and badly lit as it always was. But everyone acts as if the anti-air batteries are all we need. Hello. Ah, oh, Shulk, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. I've broken my watch. Look, it's in pieces. I'm terrible with machines like this. Even little ones like this. Would you mind fixing it for me? You don't have to be good with machines to be careful with them. You just have to be careful. Wasn't your father good with machines? Sorry, I'd have to go through fixing things. I'd sorry, I'd I'd have thought fixing things would be the first thing he'd teach you. Not just good. He was amazing. When I was little, I used to marvel at how he swung that hammer. But he's gone now. As hard as I try, I can't be like he was. I'm sorry, Desiree. I didn't mean to be rude. I can't be doing the English accents. I, there's no way I can take the story seriously if I'm doing English accents the whole time. Every now and then, sure. But... Uh, it's so easy to make you go all timid. Seriously, don't worry about it. It's been a year since then. I'm back on my feet. Anyway, are you going to fix my watch or not? I guess I can try. Oh, I have a lab? Brilliant. I'll leave it in your capable hands. It's in pretty bad shape! I'll have to use the equipment in the lab, so it might take a while. Hello. I'm here skiving off, and she won't even come and take me back. She's completely useless. Hello. Unless she gets her act together, I'll be on patrol for my whole life. I can't handle that. I think the game looks pretty nice. So far. It's not like blowing me away necessarily, but it's it's good. The art direction is pretty nice and some of the environments are great. It's yeah, it's okay. Who's this? Oh, I'm thinking of making some kind of trap for catching insects. I just don't have time to get all the materials I need. Will you help a guy out? Ah oh, Jesus. Thanks. Can't wait to start building it. King Squeeze. What's up? Don't know what you think talking to me will achieve. I'm just your everyday common or garden money lender. You want me to be more precise? Alright then. I'm the creditor for a certain good for nothing critic. One who's overdue on his payments. What's up? Now, what's someone like you doing somewhere like this? Stay where it's safe, like the ether light in the uh, commercial district. A kid like you could get hurt hanging around a place like this. Clearly, I'm a very strong, strong man. Look at my, uh... Prodigal Type 3? Is that that? Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, that's- that's the Shulk outfit that I'm talking about. I remember, um, in the last story, which is a game on the Wii, it was an RPG, that I actually really didn't like all that much, but I- I like aspects of it. But it had the best thing in a video game, which was, um... It had a, a banana crossbow, and you could shoot banana peels at the people in the town. Hello. That was the only thing I really liked. That and like the music was pretty cool, and yes, the battle system wasn't all that amazing, but. It was- it was an okay game that I never finished because I got too frustrated by the end of it, but I, um... I liked the banana crossbow the best. That was nice. Hi there. It's weird. 
My heart should be pounding, shouldn't it? I mean, we've been going out long enough for some sparks to fly, but instead I just feel empty and alone. Am I overthinking things? Hi there. The last guy was a wild one, so I went for an elegant type this time. I guess this won't work out either. Where the fuck am I going, man? Please. Okay, I think I know. I see the exclamation marks. Wait, are those quests that I've accepted already? No. What the hell is this thing? What is this thing? They're like little dinosaurs. A good sleep at night, but they're snoring so loud, my sleep not good. Hello. I lost something really important my wedding ring. Uh, it's so small, I've looked all over, but I can't find it anywhere. Could you help me out? I really don't want my wife to have to go at me. I'm counting on you. Having a go? I want a bit of a, of a thrash. So the exclamation marks are... Those are quests that I've yet to get. Oh boy. Boy, this is... Uh, you know what? Let's just go to the spot. Again, this is my first time ever playing this game. For those that just joined, this is likely... This is... You know what? This is not going to be a full stream. Like, I'm not streaming this whole game. Um, this is going to be a Dragon Quest XI type situation where I stream a little bit here and there if I get into it. Going to be doing a lot of it on my own. And I apologize in advance, but I know a lot of people wanted to see me play this game and the first part of it. So here it is. So far, it's pretty good, but Charlotte's not in the game. You idiots! What the hell are you playing at? Uh-oh. The colonel's gonna explode. Crashing the mobile artillery what? into a house. How long have you been in the force? Sorry, sir. It's just that we were trying to go as fast as we could, like you ordered. But it's impossible to get back to the military district in only 40 seconds. I don't want any excuses. Champions don't whine. They win. Yes, sir. <laughs> Why is this music? Grace to the uniform. Are you forgetting the shame you brought on this force during joint maneuvers with Colony 6? Stick your back into it, maggots. Move it. Yes, sir. Get the artillery back to the military district, double time! Then I want a million press-ups from both of you, and you better not stop until your biceps explode! Colonel, we can't move the artillery. What? You better give a damn good reason why. Sir, the impact of the crash damaged the ether conduction cable. The ether fuel proceeded to leak out, and now the cylinder is empty. Well, change the cylinder then. Can't you even do something as simple as that? The auxiliary cylinders have all been used up. It'll be three days until more come in, sir. I told you to keep us. Look stock at these of fuel arm movements. Reserve. Sorry, sir. You're nothing but slackers. Whoa, we got walloped. Same old colonel. At this rate, the men will all be dead before they see any action. Yeah, there's some motion blur on those arms. Wow. What's up? Have you ever been to the pool below Outlook Park at night? There's a monster called Lake Magdalena that appears there. It would mean a lot if you could eliminate it once and for all. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll take care of the monster. Such courage. 
from the Defense Force soldier asking a child with no pants to take out the monster. Seems... It's perfectly reasonable. Well done. Yes. Put your backs into it! Get a move on, you maggots! Yes. What? Ten million press-ups? Now! You wanna do something all? <laughs> Me? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Mephimifi thinks Hom Hom feel better just by having her around. It's so strange because Mephimifi is no pun and not Hom Hom. <laughs> what? <laughs> Me? Mephimifi will always keep doing her healing research. Friends want to know why Mephimifi have power to heal people. Mephimifi want to know why too. Okay. No puff puff. No pom-pom, no hom-hom. It's my favorite member of the Queens of the Stone Age, Josh Hom-hom. Shulk's running animation? is, like, really funny to me. <laughs> Especially with the le <laughs> with the legs. It kind of looks like it's half a John Cleese doing a funny walk. But he's also kind of, like, sneaky. Like, he's, he's shulking around. What's up? Some ridge antols have appeared outside the commercial district. Can you go and take care of them for me? Nice one. You get more of them ridge antols around at night. It's not an easy job, but you should be able to handle it. Huh. Vinny, he has more quests. There was a whole big portion of chat that was like, don't worry about doing every quest. But I know what you're looking for. What a boring job. It's not that bad, really. When you're out and about at this hour, second thoughts, I better not say anything. Hello. Got great night vision, you see. I guess duty comes first and all that. That wasn't the same guy. I see it. I see it. What's up? There are a load of cute brogs on the beach near anti-air battery one. What's wrong with their cute? Could you get rid of one of them for us? Defense force is a bit short-staffed at the moment. Excellent. Sorry I keep asking you for help. Cute brogs only come out at night, so watch yourself out there, okay? You have another quest for me, don't you? What's up? Bunch of colony crabbles attacking people. They live near Cliff Lake. Can I count on you to take them out? Oh my god. Having you is like having 100 extra troops. It really is like playing an MMO. It's like I never stopped playing World of Warcraft 15 years ago. How's it going? Hmm. Sorry, I don't have the energy to be chatting with you right now. I won't get any research done. Sorry, what research is happening here? Hi there. I'm always at my happiest when I'm near Eric. Excuse me now, I must find Eric. You're distracting me from staring at Eric's good looks. Where is he? I don't know where he is, it's strange. Where is he? Hmm. If only I could make the residents' lives better through my research. But I guess nothing's that easy. And now it's New Zealand. Hi there. Eric, 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 Eric. Oh, did you feel that too? I just got a feeling that something, someone other than you was watching me. Must be my imagination. Yep, my, yep. My, my 
English went into Australian and now New Zealand, and I don't know what the hell's going on anymore. What is it? There are a lot of scientists in this colony, don't you think? Even lots of young, up-and-coming ones. The others are all so prolific, it just makes things worse for me. What is it? I simply cannot decide on what area to concentrate my studies on. Ether? Monsters? Homs? Giants? Hi, Entia? Mekon? Whoa, that is some loud-ass lightning I just heard. You didn't hear that, did you, chat? There are already people studying all of those. Come on, Nado. All right, Shulk. How are you? Oh, Dixon. he lived. When did you get back to Colony 9? <laughs> Just now. I see you've been busy. Looks like your Monado research has been going well. I made the right choice leaving you in charge. <laughs> your research notes really helped. So, you can activate it now. It does look like the Tiger King a little well, bit. anyone can activate it. The problem is controlling it. Yeah, for everyone except him. Yes. If anyone other than Dunban were able to control the Monado, we could surpass any military force in the world. You think so? What are these hidden functions you mention? It's still only conjecture, but it's starting to look like the Monado might be something far more significant than just a weapon for defeating Mechon. I see. And the evidence to support your theory? It's the symbol that appears in the center when it's activated. What I know is, the central piece is made from multi-layered glass. The symbol appears on the top layer, and each layer is constructed differently. So it's possible that other symbols could appear on different layers. Which means... The Monado might conceal even more power. Am I right? Speed! If we could just... Unlock the Monado's power. Buster! Dunban! Dunban! Prioritize the most civilly injured! Come on, get a move on! Dunban! Don't look like that. I haven't come yet. Oh. Rose, Rose, Rosebud. The fuck is Rosebud? It was the Monado. It was controlling me. Even so, it saved us. Saved our future. Next, it will be up to you. <gasps> Dunban. Well, I better get the supplies delivered to the defense force. I'll drop round the HQ and see how they're getting on. Okay then. I'll see you later. Shulk, you're spending too much time in the lab. Either that or rummaging for junk in the scrapyard. It ain't healthy for a kid your age. That's why you're always looking so pasty. You should get out and get some fresh air once in a while. <laughs> All right. I'm paler than I'm Shulk. Off. Did he just wave at the camera? Alright. Alright, and, uh, Carl. Oh, he lived? Dumbass, are you awake yet? Maybe. Is this real life? 
Ah, <sighs> is it time to eat already? You didn't have to bring it yourself. You could have just called me. Don't be silly. Do you want me to feed you? <laughs> Don't treat me like an invalid. I'm better than I was a year ago. Much better. <sighs> I really thought I lost you back then. Yes, but now I'm almost well enough to handle the Monado again. Dumban, don't say that. The Meccan have gone now. Oh, why would you say that? <laughs> I just mean I'm prepared. Sorry. Okay. More importantly, eat up before it gets cold. I made something really special today. Don't feel like you need to stay here then, Fiora. Go and make your next delivery. Huh? I had a steak. Well, I'm sure you'd like Shulk to try some while it's still hot. That's okay. Shulk has no sense of taste. He'll say it's delicious even if it's stone cold. <laughs> In which case, today he would actually mean it. Hmm, maybe. I'm fine, Fiora. Off you go. Okay. Dumban, thanks. Uh, oh. Oh. This is hard to watch. I, Poor dude. I'm not finished yet. I have to be prepared to use the Monado again. Find Shulk and give him the food. Story quests become available, and there's the icon. It's very nice. So this is Fiora. Chat likes Fiora. Sorry, chat. I don't know. The faces in this game, I'm trying to... Can, can we get a uh, comparison image? Can anyone link me an image of their original faces for comparison purposes? Because they are very crusty. What's up? Aren't you taking some food for Shulk? You'd better hurry up. It won't taste very nice if it gets cold. They did a pretty good job, from what I can see. Like, I think the comparison photos... Um, from me, I'm like, oh, okay. This game definitely looks... looks better. There you go. Um, there's one example. There she is. Vinny, the new style is too anime. I mean, it's pretty different. It may be improvement for some. It may, you know, you may not like it, but I... Not having gone through the whole game the previous way, I can tell you that I think, um... I think they did a good job learning how to make stylized and better-looking faces. Dixon! Looks like you're in a hurry. Where are you off to? I just thought I'd take Shulk some food. I'm on my way to the lab. Shulk's not there right now. Really? I just sent him out to get some fresh air. You know where he'll have gone. Outlet Park. That's the one. Okay. Thanks, Dixon. Dunbar and Dixon, are they in a band, right? Which one plays the guitar? Which one plays the bass? Someone said I'm on a timer for this. Oh, because the food's gonna get cold. No. Alright, never mind then. That's a quest. You are not on a timer. I was gonna say, this game has, like, cold food physics? That's crazy.
Wow, what a what a difference between that and eat. <laughs> Power smash! Yes, but do you feel it? We almost didn't make it. Really feeling it. Choke. Put on some pants, Legado. mate. It's the only sword that's effective against the mech on armor. They say that before time began. It was wielded by the Bionis. The same Bionis that we all live on. It must have a secret. That's how Dunban was able to destroy so many Mekon. And why he lost the use of his right arm. If I can just unlock the secret of its power. Shulk! Fiora! Mm. This is great. It tastes so good. <laughs> really? It's amazing. Oh, Shulk. You say that every day. Not quite. Mm. It's always delicious. But today, it's amazing. It's just, it's, I can't take it serious. Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. I used some special herbs and spices today. So if you said it was just the same as usual, I'd know for sure you have no sense of taste. What? Oh, nothing. I have to put the pant back on. Ah, oh, the breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this always. It won't be. It's the beginning of the game. Huh? The debris siren. Strange. There hasn't been much falling lately. Oh, the debris siren. I thought debris was the name of, like, a person. There might be more on the way. The anti-air batteries can't protect us out here. Let's get back to the lab. Okay. Shulk said it was even more delicious than usual. Characters can shout out an affinity cry to another party member to encourage or assist them depending on how the battle is going for them. Encourage dispirited party members. Um, help party members suffering days or topple encouragement and help improve the affinity between two party members. If the affinity between two party members is deep enough, they can have a heart to heart. What, like in Fire Emblem? Search for the handshake icon. Why not check it in Outlook Park? You can change the party's leader in the party member, uh, menu member. I mean, you know, Shulk is a guy from Smash, so. Hey Shulk, you remember that time we watched the sunrise right here? Is when we were quite young. Yeah, I remember. We came because our 
Uh, I invited you. You don't remember, do you? And since when have you ever invited me to do anything? Oh, um, I could have sworn that's what happened. No, silly. I had a big fight with Dunban. You ran out of the house. Oh, yeah. It's all coming back to me now. Oh, if I'm remembering right. Um, even I got shouted at. Yeah, Dunban was pretty angry. But I shouldn't have said I was going to run away from home. Oh, you really had him shaking up. He was worried about you. I know. I'm sorry you didn't have to stay with me all night. Of course I did. Besides, it was fun. I'll do it again in a heartbeat. It was fun. How did you get over there? Little Skeeter. What was that? You can quick travel with Y. See. Well, I'm going to try to complete the, um, the quest down there. Why not? Little Skeeter evolves into laser loads. Thanks, Nary. Always with the pertinent information. It's an interesting way of swimming. I also, I think I kind of um, botched it. I saw some exclamation marks. I think I had to kill those those things. I don't know, maybe. Maybe that was what it was. Uh, no. No, I'm pretty sure we didn't... No. Oh, I have to kill these anyway. You really can just give them encouragement. You're just like, Mate, you're pretty good. Oh, that was the wrong attack. Damn it. Press B for the stat boost. I gotta do that. I'm gonna do it. Actually, death is kind of in our sight. Oh, you recover HP really quick out of battle. Okay, that's one less thing to worry about. Vinny, those aren't quests you have? What the hell did I just get? I just got a thing. I don't know what it's for, though. What did I get? Put pants on? I do have pants on. 
Then you got a rain, rain weapon. Rain. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I definitely have the pants on. They're just not visible. I was listening to the Song of Ice and Fire, a Feast for Crows audiobook years ago. You know, when the show and the sh and was good and the books were still being written. And um it wasn't the usual audiobook narrator, Roy Dotrice. It was some other dude cuz Roy couldn't do it. And he would say the names of the characters, and like, you know, and, and he didn't have pronunciations for some of them, so he called Brienne, Brian. And that was before she was in the show. You know, it was really, like, after season one, I was reading the book, so. So I'm, like, listening to this audiobook, and he's like, Brian. I'm like, uh, what? That's how you pronounce that? Oh, God. I'm looking for, um, there was exclamation marks over here, chat. Over here. Ah, yes. Can we fight underwater? No, we can't. This will do, however. I almost pressed the button that time. So, um, when is, uh, oh, there we go, now you're joining me, thanks. So, we dead. Okay, so, yeah, what happens when you die? Do you, you just get warped back? Is that it? It's just a waste of your time. Okay, <laughs> well, that's fine then. Oh, that reminds me, I should probably save. I know there's auto-saves, but just in case. There we go. Didn't press it at the right time. Why not fight? Why you no fight? You selected flee? I guess I did. What's nice is the enemies don't just run at you and you have a chance to like oh. And you have a chance to um like weave in and out of them a little bit and not just get destroyed by enemies that are going to be annoying. It's a very good quality of life. I'm sh- oh, Vinny- uh, oh, okay, it's just because these are lame enemies, aren't they? Okay, oh. I love when chat says he doesn't know. Vinny, some enemies are attracted-
pop and booty was what he, the chat member said. Attracted to pop and booty. I hit the mute button on my keyboard by accident. I was like, why is chat doing a bit? And then I realized that I muted myself by accident. Residential district. Oh, I thought I was going to like quests that I still had to do. Or that I um, was able to complete. Or what and whatever. There's quests here. Like many no pony colonies so Nira Nira had no friend to play with. <laughs> Sounds like you've got a problem. Thank you, thank you. There are Hom's boy called Lucas. Nira Nira want to be friends with him. Nira Nira waiting for you. No problem. Leave it to me. Don't read letter. It's like I'm bringing the letter to Scoop. Gonna open it up. Check. What do you want? A letter from who? Nira Nira, I read it now. Tell Nira Nira I want to be friends with him. I always wanted a Nopon friend. This should be really fun. He was like right there. Alright. I did the quest. That's cool. Lucas read Nira Nira's letter? Lucas, such a nice boy to agree to be Nira Nira's friend. I'm glad everything worked out. Thank you, Nira Nira, go play now. Vinny, you have to do everything around here? Are you joking? I can feel myself getting stronger. That was like a Trials of Mana line. I can feel myself getting stronger! Where's my shiny treasure? I get sad if I don't look at it every day. I'd be really happy if you find it it for me. Finded it. Those, that's like Vinny words. I make- I say words that are that good. Well? I've been getting complaints from customers, sorry to ask, but could you get me some kind of glowing rocks? Thank you. Well, it was easy. Well? There are so many problems here with people just like me. If you help them, you'll increase your affinity with that area. Your area affinity is like how people see you in, in the certain area see you. So even helping one person will affect how everybody sees you. I used to see this bug around all the time, but it's gone now. I would like to see it again. Could you catch it for me? Giant hornet? Okay. Wait, you want it? You want the giant hornet? Why? Why do you want the giant hornet? Wasp poop. Well... All of my Animal Crossing has paid off. I was born for this. God damn it. Alright, maybe I can buy Shulk some better pants now. For real this time. With the amount of money I'm making from these quests. Wait, did the quest just complete itself? 
Like, did I not have to go back and deliver the item? Is it like that all the time? Or no? Most complete automatically. That's- that's pretty cool. My legs are really cold! Named NPC quests are usually the ones that don't autocomplete. Okay. What's up? There's some like flammy on the beach. Now, aren't I about to one? We could take a couple of them out for me. We regularly exterminate the monsters around the batteries. Helps keep them safe. It's a great help. We've been so busy with other tasks lately. Be careful. Jesus, they have so many quests. I mean, I, you know, if I'm passing through there anyway, I may as well just do them then. Just fight when the time comes, you know? How many? You got more? What's up? Stone crabbles. Listen, I, I, if I do this game. You know, I'm planning on not doing every single one of these little quests. I'm just gonna get them. If I manage to be able to do them in my journeys, great. I'll probably do some of the more pertinent ones. But, um... Yeah, people were saying there's like 30 hours or more of side quests in this game. And that's, that's all well and good. I'm gonna be a little bit more smart about which ones I take. Ryan? Ryan, what are you doing? Sh sh shulk. Uh, um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just. No! Wow. Oh my God. Goodness. Ooh. Oh, Fiora, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Ah, uh, it's broken. What? What do you mean it's broken? Don't you care about me? I could have died. You're not hurt, are you? The Monado can't cut people. More importantly, what were you thinking, Ryan? Sorry, I... I came to ask a favor, but you weren't here. And I saw the Monado, and... I know I'm here a lot, <laughs> but even I need fresh air sometimes. Is your body still feeling numb? Body. We have to be very careful with the Monado. It's not a toy. I know, man. I just wanted to touch it. Didn't know it would do that. Sorry. But is it true... The Monado really can't cut people? The pattern in that circle. Or maybe it's a symbol. I think it shows which power the Monado has at the moment. You think it's a symbol? Well, if I can find a way to increase the number of symbols, I should. I'm sure that's all very clever. But why were you more worried about a machine than me, Shulk? Well, I just... I just explained why. That's not the point! But why male models? Uh, s sorry. Look at you! What? Oh, it's Taser Face. Each and every one of you. So, of course, I want to get my revenge. Your blade, it did not cut deep enough. No! 
All right, well, thanks for spoiling the whole game for me, game. Shulk! Shulk! It's also, Whoa, Tifa's in this game with there. a sniper rifle. Ryan. Fiora. Are you okay? Does it hurt? No. Ryan, when you held the Monado, did you see anything? You know, like a blue blade made of light came out. Same as just now. <laughs> I don't mean that. A feeling like time had stopped, and then time had stopped. So, was it only me who saw that? That sounds strange. Is it another Monado thing? Who knows? <laughs> These pants. Anyway, no pants. No Sorry. How good a sword it is. That's what happens when you hold it. Looks like Dunban really is the only one who can use it. I won't let my brother use it ever again. Not after what it did to him. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, the point is I'm fine. To be honest, this has happened a few times before. I've been researching the Monado for a long time. Shulk, don't act as if this is nothing. Look, don't worry about it. Anyway, Ryan. Deploying smooth jabs. Oh, yeah. Uh, old Square Tash has gone and put me on punishment duty. Fancy tagging along? Punishment? The Colonel was pretty angry today. Did he hit you? Well, whether he hit it's, me or not, it's not jazz. It just, there, really. It's almost started that way. Although, actually, he did end up hitting me. And that ain't all. He made me do a thousand squats and sit ups. Whoa. Nasty. Yeah. And now I have to go all the way to the Magmel ruins and back. So you have to go and collect the ether cylinders. That's the one. They're used to power the mobile artillery. Looks like the damage has been repaired. They can't move without the ether energy. And it seems like the fueling station's all out of stock. Is the mobile artillery that big machine that crashed in the residential district? Yeah, probably. You know your way around there, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll go with you. Yeah, knew you would. Hold on. The Magmel ruins are in Tefra Cave, right? I heard that there's a male lizard nest there. What? I couldn't take it if anything happened to Shulk. He's delicate. What? No, not he's like not. You, Ryan. Wait, is he delicate? What are you on about? Huh. I'll be fine. I can take care of myself. But. Okay, I got it. I'll make you a promise. Shulk won't even get a scratch. A promise doesn't mean much coming from you. Nah. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> she don't trust me at all. Nah, she doesn't mean it. Do you know when Tyler Durden laughs in Fight Club while getting beat up and he makes that weird laugh? That's what I just tried to do, I think. I, I don't even- I didn't try to, it just happened. Select arts from the menu for further information about leveling up. See the tutorial. Skill trees. Bad news about Desiree's watch, though. It's worse than I thought. I haven't got the right parts. I need three blue chains. Well, I got one from trading. So we're gonna do more trading. I like Shulk's lab. It's cool. Oh, I see. So we can level up. Um, I can choose one to level up. Recommendations? Backslash and light heal. I'll start with backslash. I'll do light heal next. Where's, uh, there he is. How about for- for this dude? Just early recommendations are helpful for now, that way I can understand. Slice the enemy's feet, inflicting topple. So, people are saying wild down is a good one. That's, that's good advice, thank you chat. I'll take skill trees now. And, um, we got integrity, humanity, and tuition. Oh, I see it. Like, Matches their personality. Healing arts restore more HP.
Allows medium weight armor to be equipped. Or more HP is restored when reviving a party member. Intuition starts with increases tension gained from battle start affinity. So if I press the B button, any unlocked skills are permanent. So when you you level them as you hold on to them. I see. Um, increases max HP, so that makes him a little bit tankier. Um... That's good. This one's got S, so it's got an empty slot, but I don't have any things. Okay. That's cool, though. It's empty slots and stuff. Is there an easy way to, like, auto-equip, or it, I have to go through it manually? Not that I mind. I'm just... It's all manual. All right. All right, let's go. Wait a minute, was that? Fiorelli? Huh? Yeah, that's her. Have you forgotten anything? Tefra Cave is dangerous, right? You have to be prepared. pick up whatever quests I can. I, you know, grab a bunch of quests. And then go, uh... So, for the, the, the broken chains, I'm assuming I have to, uh, do some trading. Do you know about evil Rangrot? <laughs> That's me! I, my name is Rangrot. Vinny, you missed a gem? What? Where? It's on Tefra Hill. I've been ordered to kill it by myself. That's impossible for one person. Can you go and do it for me? You find some outside the entrance of town. Hello there, youngin. Got something to interest you. Rather, something to tell you. It's about this here furnace. When creatures die, they leave ether crystals behind. Everyone knows that, don't they? Ether particles in the body are, uh, <clears throat> oops, that stuff's too complicated. Just remember that creatures drop ether crystals when they die. But I haven't got the best part ready, uh, yet. Or got to it yet, ready? Don't be shocked! This furnace compresses ether crystals and removes impurities. You use it to make ether gems. What? No reaction? Hm, <laughs> kids these days. You don't know how amazing this thing is. You can use the furnace to make ether gems. They've got the powers of ether crystals, but highly condensed. They're materia. They give you all sorts of powers. They're great for the home or for defense force. Put them in weapons, armors, or uh, with slots. What? It's not much of a reaction. Never mind. That weapon of yours will do fine. Strength all HP up, too. Cool. Okay. It's, a, it's like a light materia system. The furnace is broken down. Oh. Hell yeah. Hand bunnets. Kill them. You got more? Oh my gosh. 
You got more. <laughs> you got more. Hi there. Hello. Bang teeth. Grandma needs them. Go get them. Um, I think it turned a certain time and people just, like, disappeared. Can I rewind the time? How, how do I... Mm. Well, that's, like... Incredibly easy. So it's like a functional day-night system, but more for aesthetic purposes. And you can just rewind when needed. Yeah. That works. Bash monster on head. That's what I do. My name is Shulk. We're, we're the No Pants Gang. We go and beat up monsters. Fuck you. Find the key. She can't get into her house because her key is missing. Millions and billions of quests. I mean, yeah, at this point, whatever ones I manage to accidentally complete, that's fine by me. Good day. That said, I probably want to buy some better stuff, maybe, right now. I don't know. You don't need to? Alright, never mind. Always nice to hear acoustic guitar. I don't know, I feel like we're, we're, we're kind of like assholes for beating up these poor defenseless bunnies, but... Then again... In Terraria, I've, uh, I've killed many bunnies by accident. <clears throat> Vinny, you peed on a duck. Yeah, I didn't think it was gonna kill the duck, but it, it, it definitely did kill the duck. Oop, too soon. I like how, um, nonchalant he is about feeling it. That's good. I'm- I'm- I'm happy for him. Sometimes it's nice just to feel anything. Good thing I'm here. No! Anyone? So I already like this dude. Did he just say, get a job, everyone? He didn't say that. Okay, never mind. I mean, again, at least the quests are numerous, but the enemies are on the way, right? So... We can't lose! This one's mine! Ah, I'm really feeling it! Yes, you're... Get stuck in! Ah. Ah. Alright, I'm feeling it! Bollocks. Please tell me someone says bollocks in this game. Oh, 
Of course. Oh, good. Okay. I, I think I'm starting to understand the, the battle system and, and how you have to, like... You know, position your characters in order to get maximum, uh, feeling it. Backlash! For low resolution! Oh, fuck. You'll, you'll be all right. Just go get him. Go get him, partner. Cooldown based and position based. Well, I don't really love the MMO ness. I do like pressing the button and having the sword slash, but that's just me. But um. I like it so far. I can see myself getting into it. The combat. It's it's solid. I mean, it works really well. But, you know. To each their own. I'm more of a Snack World fan myself. I guess we're... We're, we're not gonna get that one. I, I still just am shocked at how many times this dude says he's feeling it. I thought it was just a meme because he says it the one time in Smash. Nope, he fucking says it all the time. Unbelievable. We're, we're really... We're, we're like maximum shulking right now. Shulking sounds like something that you would do... That... If, if I were to tell you right now, chat, like you'd leave. And you'd be disgusted. Like it sounds like a gross activity. Oh, yeah, we were shulking, mate. Fucking hell. Unique monsters are stronger than other monsters. Defeat a unique monster, you'll be rewarded with better quality item. We can't lose. Leave it to oh. Oh, we get, like, boss music for this little dude. For the Rangrot. I think I healed a little too soon. Homeboy's about to die. How do I get him back? Can't yet? Oh, I'm dead. There's a lot more quest monsters over here now. I don't know what the hell were that. I mean, I, I kept all the quests that I did, so that's weird, but... I guess this is just a different breed of monster. For different quests. Achievement unlucky sixes. Good for me. Oh, I got a thing. I think I can... Can I level up some arts now? Um, I can... Yeah, light heal I can get. Which I'm definitely gonna need that. And Bone Upper and Hammer Beat. Ryan learned a new one. Oh, he did.
Swing weapon drawing aggro from enemies in range. Definitely good for him. I believe I got some kind of... There go. Better glove. Chat, maybe, maybe the reason I'm losing these battles is because I'm not wearing pants. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the pants. Let's try again. What I would like to do is, is uh, attack and kill that unique monster. Ignore until you get full party. Go to cave for checkpoint first. So wait, you're saying you don't think that I... Vincent Von Best Gamer can defeat that monster. That is a resounding no with a couple yeses. You can kill it if you heal Rhine. Okay, you know what? Like a rhinestone cowboy, I'm gonna go over there and try one more time, but let's- wait, 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 just, just go to the cave first, go to the cave first, alright. What do I think of the game so far was someone's, um, question. I mean, it's really early, two hours for a JRPG is not a whole lot. Um... Yeah, I like it. I think it's cool. I'm gonna try to continue playing it. Um, my- sadly, my Animal Crossing has slowed way down. Just because I feel, you know, like I enjoyed my two and a half months with it, and, and I'll- I'm not really playing it on my own, so I'll probably play this. So I like it, yeah, it's good. You forgot something? You will be needing the transport cases, right? Fiora. <gasps> ah! I'm coming along as well. I'd feel better going with you boys than sitting at home worrying about you. So, let's get moving. <sighs> I knew she didn't trust me. Looks like it. Party gauge has been added. Shows the party's morale. The gauge increases when a boost effect or critical hit occurs. Press B to revive them. Oh, now I can go over there and take care of that. Um, revive a party member. There needs to be at least one block in the party gauge. When there are three blocks, the party is linked and interlinked by cells by a blue line that can perform a chain attack. Use up and down to select chain attack icon. Press A to confirm. Alright, cool. And apparently there's a checkpoint here, yes. so... Going into the cave. Can you kill a willow bun bunniv? Yes. Yep, I just now I know that they have many millions of quests. Yes. Oh, it's like a hippity hop thing, you know, bunniv. It's like a bunny, but with an iv. That's how we make it unique. People are saying, lose the pants, lose the shorts. If you're good, chat, maybe we can lose the shorts again.
There are many types of monsters. It's shown in the target window. You can toggle enemy icons on or off. Ordinary monsters will not attack them you unless you attack them. Visual types will attack when they see your character. Okay. So chat. There is like a big people were saying there's a moment when you leave a place that I should stream until because that would be fun. How much longer? Is that from here, would you say? Another hour? Two hours? Thirty minutes? Oh, because I was going to switch to Terraria. I've been going like two hours. How about we do another stream of this? Hey? I'm going to stop after I kill the, um, the unique monster. So, as a bonus, I will stream... Part two, I won't play until I stream it. And that way, we'll get all that stuff, whatever you want to see from there, plus I, I can, you know, stream whatever's next, and then I'll just play it on my own from there. I'm probably going to miss good moments if I play the game like this, and I'm going to play the game like this. I don't plan on streaming everything. So... So yeah. Yeah, it'll be cool, but I'm... I... I... I whoa, oh, there we go. That was a waste. You've been healed, mate. All together now, all together now. If um, someone is dead, they don't get experience, or does it matter? They do get the experience? Okay. I got uh, bonnet crystals, messenger shoes, and night goggles. Why is- why is he- oh, is he Rage? You get experience from discovering new areas and achievements, too. Okay. Oh, his Ungar was maximum? I see. Night Goggles. Designed for night patrol. Does this have an actual effect? Night vision, 12%, and that does... Increases accuracy of physical attacks at night by 12%. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, well, Ryan could probably use them. What, well, um, it's just, I wish I could remember the other shit that I was getting. Like, I know I got something else, I just don't remember what it was. Oh, it's shoes. Um, agility up. Okay. So, effects. Agility up, that's just agility up, that's easy. Um, yeah, clearly we want to equip this. On, uh... Fior. I had to remember her name for a second. Agility is OP in this. Cool. Uh, and I'll take one more suggestion until I learn the game a little bit better for Fior's uh, stuff. Screw Edge? 
is always good. Upward cleave that breaks the enemy's stance. Okay. Summon all fears might to attack, dazing the enemy. Let's see if we can get that skill tree going. What do we have here? Increases counterattack rate when HP is at half. Increases block rate when HP is at half. Or grant strength up buff at start of battle. Get that for now. Yeah, it's a cool game. I mean, again, RPGs are a weird thing for me, because I haven't played a lot of new RPGs, you know, over like 20 years. And now I'm playing a lot. Well, not a lot, lot, but, you know, you've had, um, I just, I'm finishing up Trials of Mano, so that's not like a strict JRPG, that's more action RPG. And then you have uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake, which is a remake, but it's still, it was a pretty lengthy game. Um, Dragon Quest XI. Then before that, I did Mother 3 for the very first time. So, it's a lot of new JRPGs. Good ones. New to me, Mother 3. Otherwise, this is also new to me. This is 10 years ago, but still pretty new to me. I've, I've enjoyed them. Oh, I've definitely enjoyed them. I, I, again, I just didn't know which ones to play, and I'm always afraid to take the plunge in a game that's about 100 hours. For, you know, reasons of life. And also reasons of wanting to be able to stream games and not have them take three months to complete. Um, but I will say that this game is, so far, very, very good. Like, the polish is visible. It's a very polished, cool game. A lot of, um... The resolution has been fine. It's a little chunky here and there in certain areas, but... Looks good. Sounds good. Um, I... The characters aren't... Die Hard Man. So that's nice. I like them. So I think I'm gonna probably get into this, but I will stream part two. So we'll get to see the cave and some other shit. And then I'll just play it on my own for a while. So I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Good enough to keep streaming. No, 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 I will not be streaming this whole game, chat member. I'm sorry. <laughs> but good. But good. Definitely good. And in a game like this, the little delay on my capture card doesn't even really matter so much. So, uh... That's cool. Vinny, is this on the Switch? Yep, it's a Switch game. Alright, well that was surprisingly uh, enjoyable. I, I enjoyed the uh, game. Good is good. Need more time to really have it gestate, but good start. Um, why don't we do some Terraria? Eh? Take a quick break. And, uh, you know, I'll be back with Terraria. I can show you my mushroom houses. Stick around if you want.
uh, I think one of... Queens of the Stone Age, don't play a song while I'm talking about Jimi Hendrix. That was weird. Um, Jimi Hendrix was probably one of my... You know, he was the one of the, the first bands that got me into classic rock with The Doors. It was Jimi Hendrix and The Doors. My cousin made me a mix CD of Jimi, and I got The Doors as well. And those two bands led to Zeppelin and Floyd, you know. But Jimi, I was definitely a big fan of his voice, which I know a lot of people, you know, they compliment the guitar. And he was one of the best, but also really good voice. And he was always self-conscious about it. He didn't really like his singing voice. I think it was great. Honestly. So, Castles Made of Sand is the name of that song. Um, sad song. Definitely has some pretty bittersweet lyrics, but maybe that's why I like it. Also, a uh, lot of Red Hot Chili Peppers in that song. Well, a lot of that song in Red Hot Chili Peppers. You can hear where Frashanti got it from. Yeah, Little Wing is real good, too. Little Wing is great. Pretty much anything on um, Are You Experienced is great. Axis Bold of Love. Like, there's there's only a couple albums. He didn't really give us too much. Died too young. But, man, what a run. <laughs> 